I watched one guy channel. I be getting I be getting a lot of the YouTube channel's name mixed up, but he looked at a, I guess they call it a jailbreak Hellcat wide body. I guess that's what it is. And they wanted a hundred thousand dollars for that car. <laughs> that's crazy. And I don't, I don't think they make, they don't make none wide bodies no more, do they? Do you have to get a wide body? I'm not for sure. But I think if I got any Dodge vehicle, I would get uh, a 392 Jeep Wrangler. That's what I would get. <laughs> I would get a 392 Jeep Wrangler. Special order, I'll check every bell and whistle on it. I'm going to drive that sucker. <laughs> I ain't going to have it as no. Bet one day it'll be worth some money, but I end up driving mine. I drive the heck out that sucker. <laughs> I don't know if I would drive it to work putting 100 miles on it each day, but a few days out of the, out of the month, especially during the summer months, I would drive it to work. The one I seen, I seen on TFL truck, it had with like the roof. The roof, it just peeled back. It didn't, the sides and stuff didn't come off. It's like the, uh, I don't know if you call it a bikini top, but it's, I don't think it's a bikini top. It's the top where the middle just rolled back. I think it's, I think it's electronic. So you just mash a button and it just rolled back down through the middle. That's pretty cool. Uh, the one I watched, they put it through the, uh, is it called a, what is they, uh, they call it the Ike Gauntlet? They put it through the Ike's Gauntlet. <laughs> Pretty cool. It's like a sound good to that 6.4 liter, 300 and 485 horsepower and almost that much torque. Pretty nice. It get out of his way pretty good. Put some big. 36, 37-inch tires on it, it'd be in there. <laughs> uh, get a nice little sound system in it. It probably come with something pretty good. I don't know what Dodge is in their Jeeps, like what's they what's they best sound system? I'm not for sure. I'm not for sure what they put in there. I'm gonna do I'm gonna do some research on it. Possibly. Watch some videos of the 392 Wranglers. And see how much them going for. I know them ain't going for a hundred thousand dollars. I bet it's close though. It got a good markup on it. I think he said he brought his for sixty something thousand dollars. That ain't bad. Cause I know at one point in time, that's how much scat packs and stuff were going. Well, that was cheaper than that, but I don't know if a, if a uh, fully loaded scat pack is going for 60,000 right now with like the markups and stuff. It might be pretty close to it, but I don't know. With the markups, what they get. It might be close to 60,000 with the marks up on it. I ain't too much keeping up with it. <laughs> Cause that's the car I would be buying, the Mitsubishi Mirage. Y'all see it? Get you almost 50 miles to a gallon. <laughs> but it had to be a manual. I have to be able to which I'm not too hard on cars, but I think the stick shift is a little better. It's a little better than the, I don't know what they got a CVT in them. It's a little better than those. I don't know if y'all see my bump. Ooh, that sucker hurt. <laughs> that sucker hurt. I don't know, maybe I'll be done for my girlfriend and get to heading home. 7.54, she haven't texted me back. 
Mm. Maybe she ain't left work yet or she ain't made it home yet. We'll be, we'll meet each other about the same time. Yep, we end up meeting each other about the same time. She end up going right to sleep. I probably just uh, clean the inside of a car out. I might stay up there for a little while. They Wi-Fi suck though. <laughs> they got some new Wi-Fi, but it's not, it's a lot. It's, I would say it's a hundred times better than what they used to have, but it's like, it's starting to, I don't know if it has like a, mm, I don't know if it's capped out. You know, you only got a certain amount of gigabytes. I'm not for sure if that's how it is. It's just a certain amount of gigabytes, but there for a while it worked pretty good. I think I uploaded like some, maybe about two to three gigabyte videos on YouTube. And it took it for for where they at and what the old internet used to be. It took it like, it took it like, like 15 minutes, granted, if I'm in Tupelo where I got real good cellular service or if I catch 5G anywhere, uh, if I catch 5G anywhere, a three gigabyte uh, video uploaded from my phone, man, that's gonna take like three minutes. It uploaded quick. So I think just where they at is just got bad service. I don't even know who they internet through. I know it's not through AT&T or nobody. I don't know who it's through. But I think AT&T couldn't, AT couldn't have to come out there and give them a, a couldn't give them a internet service out there. So I think last time they had like HughesNet. I can't think of the name of the one that they got now, but it's better than HughesNet. HughesNet was slow. It was pretty slow. Yeah. So I don't know if there's people that got huge net and it's fast for them, but down here in this area, huge net is slow. I don't even think you could do school work off of huge net internet. It's that slow. <laughs> you'll be you'll be upset getting on websites and stuff, trying to do tests and stuff. You know how they have like the online tests and stuff. You'll probably be upset doing that because it, it'll be slow doing that. But uh, yeah, let's see what they're saying the temperature is. So it's 70. I got Fenty Beauty. Cause I think <laughs> I brought my girlfriends and stuff and Fenty Beauty sent me an email every day. <laughs> I get an email every day from Fenty Beauty. <laughs> I don't want no Fenty Beauty. I think I've used it like one time cause uh, it gave me like a discount or something. I put it in just to get that. <laughs> I think it was like a 15% discount. I put it in just to get that discount. <laughs> I forgot what I bought her. I think I just brought her some like of those makeup palettes. Like for Christmas one year from Fenty Beauty. I don't know, I have to have to do a test video with my microphone cut all the way down. I might do that when I head back home from my girlfriend's house. Excuse me, I might try that and see if I can. Cause I'm gonna turn the receiver and the microphone down to its lowest. I'm gonna have to see if, uh, if that picks up music. I'm pretty sure you're gonna pick up music cause with this lab, well, that purple panda lab mic I use is like mounted right above my nose, like uh, it's like mounted right above my nose on the. Uh, I think that thing keep glare down on your helmet. It's like that little piece that go over your nose. It keep the glare down, and I mount it like right up under that. So I have to test it because I I miss listening to my music. If you're listening to my music right now, you got me feeling good. <laughs> That music make a difference. 
I need to do a one year review on these headphones. Uh, what's the name of these earphones? Let me see. Hmm. No, they call J Lab. J Lab Pops. Yeah, J Lab Go Air Pops. And I think there for a while, uh, you can only buy these that's off the off J Lab's uh, website. But I think now you can buy these at Walmart. So if you need a pair of headphones like with each earbud in that lasts each day. I mean, it's not, they not the best, like best, but they last all day. So you can wear both of them for, which is what I do. I wear them for 10 hours straight each day at work. So they don't have to, I mean, they sound decent, but it's not nothing that they like blow you away. It's just the fact that they last, that they last all day. And I probably have to charge them like every fourth to fifth day. About, about, uh, by the time I be off from work, I have to charge them. You know, after I work my work week, I have to charge them up. And I have to show y'all. They in my, I think they in the side, but the cord, which is a good and a bad thing, the charging cord is built in on side of the, the case that the headphones go in. So you never have to worry about <clears throat> having to get a charger because it's built in on there, which is a good thing. Good thing and a bad thing. Usually the way I charge them, I just plug them into my, uh, plug them in in the car and charge them up. It's like they charge up in about, I don't know, about two hours they be fully charged. I have to look at the specs and stuff, but for the price you pay for them, I don't even think they more than $30. I think they like 20 something dollars. And when I bought them off the website, <clears throat> it had free shipping. So getting free shipping on something $20 from like a business is kind of rare. Like I said, at that time, I think you can get these in Walmart now. J Lab, was it Go Air Pops? J Lab Go Pops. Yeah, J Lab Go Air Pops. So, y'all need a decent pair of headphones. Look out for those. J Lab Go Air Pops. We have one more lap after this. One more lap. I'm trying to think when they get get in the cool well, I might try to transition into up in my speed on this. Give me some good running shoes and I do a good little jog down through here. I think I jogged this like one time out of the Possibly 20 times that I came here and walked. I jogged the whole 1.3 miles. But it was a it was a cooler day, so that makes a that makes a pretty good difference. That it's cool outside. You can breathe a little bit better. Just makes a difference. Oh, look, I don't think they bagging up traffic today, at least not yet. <laughs> no, that's the ambulance or the popo. Ambulance. That's the ambulance. I 
Look at the elementary school is right by the middle school. They right by each other. So your elementary school would probably be more focused on uh about to knock their bumper off. Elementary school would be focused on uh recess and stuff. Pants I got up under here, these shorts, they're getting bunched up. Getting bunched up on me. Is it a wreck right here? Like the fire department took a different route than the uh than the ambulance. Some more coming. I don't know if it was a fire or something. I don't know. Look like traffic's starting to try to back up. I might take a different route to my girlfriend's house. See how long we're going on. 38 minutes. We about a 47 minute long video. Yeah, they kicking up dust. That's the only thing I hate, because if I water if I waterless wash my motorcycle, that does just, it just stick right back on the motorcycle. It's just the nature of that waterless wash. I put it on my rims, you know, clean my rims up real good, get them shined up. I come through here, it'll be right back dirty. That's the only bad thing about it. Yeah, they kicking up dust big time. The sun's starting to come on out. <laughs> Let's see how hot it is. Still 70 degrees. Still 70 degrees. <clears throat> Must be pretty close because I still hear the siren. Hopefully ain't a wreck or nothing. Nothing too bad. Of them cups. <laughs> so I guess the I don't know if you kind of like the little league baseball play over here. They got a uh, you got a baseball field over there. Then I guess this is the school soccer field. Yeah, two miles. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna come down here one day and. Ride in this ditch. <laughs> it's rocks under there though, so I just be kicking up water. <laughs> they got rocks down under there. It's like a kind of like the bottom of a tunnel. Got a like I don't know. You say like bricks that look like house bricks, like a brick house. They got bricks under there like that. At least in that part. Cause as you go down, you can't even see the bricks cause the grass and stuff down there. And then the mud and stuff done came over and covered it up. I 
I ain't really broke a sweat yet. <laughs> Still pretty dry. You know, if I would have came and did this, I don't know, later on today when the sun is about going down, I probably bet them broke a sweat. <laughs> Even though the sun is getting full blast. Let's see. Still 70 degrees. <laughs> We had it 40 minutes right now. Let's say about 45 minutes. Uh, I didn't start it like there for a long time on my DJI Osmos Action. I filmed in 2.7K, 24 frames per second with Rocksteady on. But here lately, I didn't start filming in 4K. Uh, 24 I would upscale my 2.7k to 4k well here lately I've been recording in 4k uh, 24 frames per second with the rock steady and stuff on and I can see a little bit bit difference in my battery life when I was filming in 2.7k it's like I can squeeze out almost a minute 30 on a battery but I don't know. 4K, I might be getting a minute 15. 4K, uh, 24 frames per second. I may be squeezing out about a minute 15. Somewhere around there, which is 15 minutes. That's a, that's a, not a huge, huge difference, but it's a difference. It's noticeable. Yep, it's noticeable. So I'm trying to guesstimate if I'm a, probably about a 10 minute ride from here to my girlfriend's house, if my battery gonna die or not. I might as well go ahead and swap it out so it don't die on me. I just swap it out. So I would say I probably got like, and I already been filming, I don't know, probably about a little over an hour with the ride here plus this walk which is going on 42 minutes from my watch and 44 minutes from the camera so i'll probably end up changing my battery out so it don't die on me <clears throat> want to get all the footage all the footage <laughs> i'm about to wrap it up though Wrap it up. But uh, yeah, when I leave from my girlfriend's house, I'm definitely going to test the microphone with the music. See if, if it's picking up the music in the microphone. Cause, which I'm pretty sure it will, even with all the settings turned down to zero. But I don't know. I guess I have to pick and choose when I'm going to film and when I'm going to listen to music when I'm riding a motorcycle. So I don't want to put no earbuds well, actually, earbuds in my ear that's playing music. Maybe if I found something that was low profile enough and had maybe had like some, maybe had noise canceling in them, possibly. I possibly could do that. But I don't think there's none really that, that low profile. With my modular helmet, I could get away with probably wearing one earbud and listen to music like when I ride the four-wheeler, but with the, I got that uh, Harley Davidson helmet on my motorcycle now. It's a little slimmer than that modular helmet. It's a little more streamlined. So, I don't think there's really no, those Galaxy Buds seem like they fit in your ear pretty good, but I don't think I want to buy some of those. I don't know, I figure something out. Like I said, maybe I just have to pick and choose when I'm gonna film and when I'm gonna uh, listen to music, but I was so used to doing it before cause I didn't have talking audio in my video. So I could, I could listen to music all the time cause it wasn't gonna pick the music up in my head, in my, pick the music up in my helmet. 
with my uh, Cinco G1A1 because I would put the, the mic in my coat pocket. So it kind of would just get wind noise and it would get the noise from a little bit of the motorcycle. You could hear me, you could hear me, uh, you could hear me talk a little bit. Like if I came to a stoplight, but for a ride you couldn't hear me, you couldn't hear me say nothing. No, uh, you couldn't hear me say nothing. <laughs> Compared to now where you hear me, you hear me pretty clear. You hear me pretty, pretty good. That's the best probably I can get it without messing with none of the settings on the on the receivers and the well on the receiver because the receiver changed both of them. I don't know, I might mess with it though. Cause I know if it, if I cut it up any louder it's gonna make it more sensitive. If I'm not mistaken. Or it just amplify the noise. So just cut the volume up. Do I push up? We gonna call it. We have to look and see what everything is, and look and see what percentage my. Oh yeah, it's in the red. <laughs> it ain't gonna make it. It's probably on like ten percent right now. It's not gonna make it. <laughs> Nope, it's not going to make it. Uh. Nope, it ain't going to make it. He riding his bike on the trail. I don't think it's a bike trail. <laughs> All right, y'all, let's look and see what we got on the watch. Hopefully y'all can see that. 47 minutes, 2.43 miles, average 16. Uh, 26 active calories, 251. Total calories, 334. Average heart rate, 130. All right, y'all. I'll catch y'all later. Y'all be good.